the mainstream media really is a problem in this regard. Because they're a problem with everything. <laughs> well, they're, they're, they're essentially a propaganda network that is passing itself off as the news. It kind of comes from Randolph Hearst mm -hmm. in a way. I mean, it certainly does. Yeah, I mean, I mean he's, he's he kind of set the tone. Absolutely. Um, but I mean, I'm sure there were people doing that before. Mm. If you have control of the newspaper, and especially back then with Hearst Publications, there's very few newspapers in, in the country, and especially right. ones that were respected. If you have control over that narrative, if you put something in the newspaper and people read it, they read that as that, oh my God, that is a fact. This is what's happening. People today are far more skeptical, particularly after the pandemic. I think the pandemic mm. kind of shook things up to a point where it's much more difficult to pass off propaganda today than it was even just four years ago. I mean, that's why I was quite excited to come on this podcast, on this experience, because I think you have actually created a space where free thought is possible and free communication. It's like a stage that you've created. I think it's actually quite an, quite an imp important artwork that mm. you have established here. Uh, I mean, it's not so easy to create like your own media that has a global reach. So thank you. 